Hello, I'm Pastor Marvin McKenzie from Bible Baptist Church in Puyallup, Washington. Welcome to today's daily visit with God. Hey, listen, if you enjoy these uh, short Bible study devotional videos, I'd like to ask if you would to click the like button and then also uh, subscribe to my feed if you haven't done so and then share with others. It would sure be a blessing to me. I'd like to read to you Genesis chapter 41 and verse 16. The Bible says, And Joseph answered Pharaoh, saying, It is not in me. God shall give Pharaoh an answer of peace. When Pharaoh first approached Joseph about his dream, he said, uh, Joseph, Pharaoh said, thou canst. He placed the, the credit, the ability on, upon Joseph. And Joseph immediately replied, set the record straight and said, it is not in me. Now, um, I think Pharaoh must have known that. How could it possibly be uh, in a man to understand another person's dreams. To uh, uh, There's no school that could teach it. Some um, psychiatric systems attempt it, but no school can teach it. Uh, it's not an inherited skill. Uh, in, in those days, even wise men were thought to possess some kind of magical or supernatural power in being possessed of a spirit or a god. Pharaoh must innately have known that it was not in Joseph to interpret the dream, but still he placed the ability upon him. And, and I think what it does is it shows that it, it is our nature, uh, though we know the Bible places all of the burden, the ability of ministry upon Christ, it's our nature to slip into this mindset that it's in man. Uh, some are born with natural abilities and some inherit uh, those abilities being brought up in a preacher's family. Some acquire them at one of the best colleges or whatever, or, or so we begin to believe. But that's not what the Bible teaches. Uh, ministry is not in man, it is in Christ. And as we surrender control of our lives to him, he performs ministry through us. So we can plant and we can water, um, but, but it is God who gives the increase or else it's wood, hay, and stubble. Joseph could have made up his own interpretation, I suppose, for um, the Pharaoh, and it would have been re believed. Given his record, it would have probably been believed, but it, but it wouldn't have helped anyone, and sooner or later it would have been discovered as a fraud. Only God can reveal the meaning that God intended it to have, and only God could foretell the future, and only God could have so moved Joseph that he had a plan regarding that future. And so it is not in man, but in God.